everyone, so I am finally back to do a video. It's been almost two weeks since I put one up, I believe. And Christmas was crazy. Then New Year's, I was in Florida because I was helping my brother move to Tampa. He now lives in Tampa. I'm kind of sad, but, you know, I'm really happy for him. So that's why I've been gone. If you follow me on Twitter and Facebook, you guys will would have known that I was in Florida, I was in Tampa, and then I was in Orlando visiting family. So I just want to get on to my top products of 2011. It's the new year and I'm so excited. So I just have a few things to show you guys that I've been loving over the past year. And I've chose products that I've always gone back to. So hopefully this will give you guys an idea of what I gonna jump into it the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is obviously the naked palette this is an amazing palette I always travel with this I took this to Florida with me every time I go to Florida because I have a lot of family there I bring this and it's the naked palette you guys know what this looks like there is the naked two out I don't have it yet because I don't know I feel like I don't need it I have so much makeup I have this huge makeup haul that I still have to do and show you guys so if you guys want to see that let me know I've been pushing it off because I don't know if I should do the huge beauty haul or not but I've gotten a lot of makeup so I have yet to get the naked too but I love the regular original naked these are the colors so this is definitely a favorite of 2011 the next thing I'm going to show you is NYX blushes I think they are amazing quality for the price it's amazing. I believe these are like five or six dollars. And this is my absolute favorite, favorite color. Don't mind my nails. I have no polish on my nails because I just got home from Florida yesterday. So, anyway, this is terracotta. I'll show you. So, this is my favorite, favorite NYX blush. And it's just amazing quality. Like, look at that color. It's just so beautiful. Absolutely love it. Find it at your Ulta and some drugstores, but definitely Ulta carries NYX, so I love this. The next thing I'm going to show you are face primers, the Rimmel Fix and Perfect. You guys know I love drugstore um, products, so two drugstore face primers. And this one's really inexpensive. I believe it's 3 or $4. It works for me. I have combination oily skin. My cheeks get kind of dry, but my T-zone's oily. So just for reference, this works for me really well. Also, the L'Oreal Studio Secrets uh, Professional. This is an amazing primer. I've actually hit pan on it, as you can see. I've used this quite often throughout this year, so I figured this would be a good product to put in this video. And then, my ultimate favorite bronzer, blush, whatever you want to call it, cheat color, is this MAC um, MSF Mineralized Skin Finish. This is called So Ceylon. Absolutely love this. This is the most amazing product ever. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite. It's a dark, kind of like rosy, goldish... I don't even know how to explain this, but this is the most amazing color to put on your cheeks. I use it as a contour and then also as a blush, so it's multi-purpose, multi-use, and I absolutely love this. This was limited edition, so that's why it kills me to show it to you guys, because it's so hard to find. This is the Milani Sunset Duo in Sunset City, and it's a bronzer blush duo, but I use the bronzer all the time. This is my favorite bronzer to wear when I'm going out to an event or to the club or something like that because it has a bit of a silver sheen to it, so it gives you a nice glow, definitely at nighttime. So, my favorite, this blush right here um, has been duped for NARS Orgasm, so if you find this, then this will probably be really useful. I've used this a lot throughout the past year. The next thing I'm going to show you is this brush, the Sigma brush. My favorite, favorite, favorite. This is the F82. And this is the, what is this? Round Top Kabuki. Amazing. I love this brush. Gives you the most flawless finish. I just love it. So I definitely think anybody should invest in one of these if you use a cream foundation, which I will show you next. But if you use a cream foundation, definitely invest in this brush. I love it. So the next product, you guys can probably already guess what it is. I've been using it since I got it. When was this? I think this was my March favorites. I don't know. This wasn't a lot of favorites, but it's the Maybelline Dream Smooth Mousse. I did a video on it. I mean, I did a review. I did a demonstration on it when I first got it, and I've been using it ever since. I love it. If you guys are 
uh, a cream foundation fan. This is an amazing cream foundation and you can find it at your drugstore and it's always like buy one get one free, buy one get one half off at drugstores. So that's always good. It's my favorite cream foundation. I've been through maybe three or four of these, maybe three. Maybe four. I don't know. I change colors, so, because in the summer I get darker. It's absolutely amazing. I use it with this brush, and I, oh my gosh, I love it. I have yet to change my um, staple foundation, because it's it's been that one for so long now. The next thing I'm going to show you is this here, the HD Powder by Makeup Forever. This has been amazing. I love using this on myself. I use this on my friends when I do their makeup when we go out because it gives you a flawless finish and it keeps your makeup on all night. I love it. So this is the HC powder. I've had this for so long and this will last you forever. So definitely invest in this also because definitely worth it. It's a translucent powder so it sets your makeup, has no color to it, but it gives you a great finish. My favorite eyeliner of the year would have to be Milani Liquify or Liquif Eye metallic eyeliner pencil amazing great creamy pigmented but doesn't kind of bleed or smear anything I love it I always wear this eyeliner and then I, I do set it with an eyeshadow so it doesn't bleed or anything but a great pigmentation and I love how creamy it is and then I have this liquid liner it's the Maybelline line stiletto I love this liquid liner I love any liquid liner that has a felt tip usually so this one looks like this, the L'Oreal Lenore or Liner Intense. Love that. I'm going to pick that one up um, after this one's done because I use both of them. They're exactly the same to me. So whichever's on sale at your drugstore, I recommend you pick up that one. So it's either the Maybelline Line Stiletto or the L'Oreal Liner Intense in black. And the last thing I want to show you is my brow product that I use. And I love this brow product. Every time I try new brow products, I always end up going back to this one. So this is the brush. And this is by Tarte. It's the angled brush. It's the perfect stiffness. It's not too flimsy. I know a lot of angled brushes can be really, really flimsy and just too soft. doesn't work. And then the, on the other side, which is really convenient, is a spoolie. So you can brush out your eyebrow hairs and just kind of blend out the color if, it, if you made it too dark. Love this brush. And then this product is my ultimate favorite brow product of the year. And it's the Tarte. Can you see that? Tarte Emphasize Waterproof. What? Waterproof Amazonian Clay Brow Mousse. I love this. It's what I'm wearing on my eyebrows right now. And mine is in medium brown. And it's so odd because they don't sell this at Sephora. I don't think they sell it on the Tarte website. And I don't think they sell it at Ulta. The only place I've seen them sell this is QVC.com. And I love it. I absolutely love it. I've been using it all year, literally. And I still have yet to hit pan. I'm about to hit pan. I can see it. But I still have a lot of product all around. And I seriously use it every single day. Um, I know there's a period of time where I use a different Tarte eyebrow product, but I always go back to this one because this one lasts forever. The other Tarte eyebrow pencil is amazing, but it lasts me like, what, a month? Not even. This has lasted me almost all year. Ever since I got it, I've been using it. I love it. It gives, it's the perfect color for me. I, it stays on. It's waterproof. I, I love it. It's amazing. So that's all my favorite products of 2011. I can't believe it's 2012. I'm so excited for the new year. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.